everyone. My name is Jenny Watkins. I'm a certified um, Access Consciousness Facilitator. And today I'm popping in to say hi, uh, because I just wanted to let everybody know that I do private online sessions. I'm not sure that I've really put it out there that um, I do that. Um, I think most people know me from facilitating Access Consciousness classes. But I thought I'd just let people know that um, I am available to do online sessions. And um, as I've been trying to write this email for the last three weeks now, and not really getting the content to where I'd like it to be, I thought, let me rather connect to you um, face to face. So um, very quickly, my background is um, primarily corporate. I started corporate, my corporate career in the 1980s, late 1980s. I was just getting divorced. I had a a baby of 18 months old and living in a town where I didn't know anybody. I had no friends or family. So from necessity, I really got my ass into gear. Um, I think I was about 23, 22, 23 at the time um, and started studying. I studied, um, became an associate of the Chartered Insurance Institute and then the fellow of the South African Insurance Institute. I worked really hard all day, studied at night, took care of my baby and I did that for many, many years until I got my diplomas and etc. Anyway, I built a really good career, but it didn't really give me what I was looking for. I still um, had bouts of depression and was anxious a lot of the time and very stressed and also was very reactionary. So I was quite emotional, used to react a lot to different situations, took things really personally. Um, so although I was doing well, it looked like I was doing well um, from a career perspective, I was um, struggling internally. I probably hit it pretty well, um, but anyway. So along the way, I um, started with positive practice. I was reading a lot of books. I attended a lot of different workshops. And I did this whole thing about trying to reprogram the mind to get out of the negative thinking. I was a very uh, negative thinker. I thought that I was a victim, that life happened to me and that I had no control. I just had to put up with what happened and um, sort it out to the best of my ability. But along the way, luckily I was introduced to different energetic healing modalities uh, where I realized that actually reprogramming the mind wasn't working for me. Um, and the reason for that, that I later on realized is because the underlying issue, the underlying belief, whatever it is, I'm not good enough, um, I don't deserve, I'm not worthwhile, um, whatever that underlying belief is that gets set up usually during childhood, if that belief is still there, the energy of that is still running. So no matter how many times you try and say, I'm good enough, I'm good enough, I'm good enough, it didn't really change Never change that underlying energy that I'm not good enough. And if you have a look at it, you wouldn't have to say I'm good enough if you didn't believe you weren't good enough. So you kind of just flipped the coin in the way, but still worked with the same energy. So when I came across these energetic healing uh, modalities and these different techniques, I found that what happened was I could change that underlying energy and shift and neutralize the charge that I had on all those different issues and beliefs, etc. So um, once I started my own personal journey of healing, I then um, decided one day that I would like to become the practitioners of this so that I could help other people change their lives too. So I started off as a body talk practitioner and then um, became a breakthrough facilitator as well, also with part of the body talk modality. Um, and then I was introduced to access consciousness and the access consciousness tools and techniques. And once I started that journey with access consciousness, I realized that those were the tools that I actually like to teach. So I'd become a practitioner to help others. And then I'm going, okay, now I can teach some of these things because, you know, it also helps if you've got tools that you can use on a daily basis um, to empower yourself. We don't always have the time and money to go find a coach or go for a session um, every day. So the in-between times, it's great if you've got something that you can use for yourself. So that's what I love about the access consciousness tools. And the other thing that I realized along the way is although I thought I needed to program the mind and then realize it's not about programming the mind, it's actually about going beyond the mind because we are more than the mind and we are more than our body. We are not just the body and mind. We are more than that. We are, um, if this is light for you or feels true for you, we are infinite beings and we are not subject to this finite reality that we've been led to believe we are subject to. So what evolved from all that was 
actually I was seeking to become more conscious. Although I didn't language it like that in the beginning, I thought I was just trying to feel better about myself. Anyway, so that's pretty much my background. I then left corporate two years ago to become a full-time access consciousness facilitator and facilitate classes around the country, um, including Botswana and Bintuk and wherever else I get invited, um, which has been an amazing, amazing journey. I've also developed my own um, workshop called The Keys to Unlocking You. And um, yeah, so now I'd just like to let you know that I also do online coaching sessions. So if you have beliefs that are holding you back, limiting patterns, it, there's negative self-talk all the time. Um, if you're not achieving your goals with ease, if you've got not having ease with relationships, if you're not having ease with money, if you're not having ease with your body or your health, any of those things can shift and change if you can let go of the underlying belief, judgment, decision, whatever it is that you latched onto that is now having an effect on your life and your body. So um, what it is, is it's a questioning process. So we'll ask questions around the issue at hand. And then as we pull it out, you will start getting a sense of what it is that you've chosen or bought into that's probably a lie most of the time that is creating this um, discomfort for you. And then we're using the tools of access, including an energetic clearing statement that neutralizes and changes the belief so that the energy is now, there has no charge in it anymore. And when it has no charge, you're not, no longer the effect of it. Um, then we can shift and change all these things for you. So if this kind of resonates with you, you're welcome to give me a call. The offer is you get a free uh, your first introductory call which is 15 to 30 minutes is for free and then after that if you like what you hear and if you like the style of my facilitation and coaching then you can book one-on-one -on -one sessions either as a package or ad hoc as you desire so um, i look forward to hearing from you i'll put a link um, with this zoom video whatever you want to call it um, yeah and i hope to catch you soon